Hello everyone, and welcome back to more Time Spinner with me, Dr. Beak. I do believe that previously we were going to go uh, to the past. Because we just finished mucking around in the future. Um, oh yeah, we can swim now. So I can go back to a lot of places actually, I think. Um, was there water back here? In the far left? I don't remember. Whatever. We're gonna go into the mines! Because we need some, I don't know, some like, amoeba stuff. Amoeba? I don't even remember what it was down here. Just that it was here. Doo -doo. Just use our lovely magical, magical MacGuffin-y electrical powers to remove slime. Oh. That works out pretty well. Do -do -do -do. Okay. What do we got? We got some spooks. That's fair. They did not fire their barbs at me, which is a little weird, but you know what? I'll deal with it. I do like me some Max Sand. Hmm. Ooh. There we go. I managed to ascend. Okay, yeah. I was afraid that it was still going to be better to waddle up to the mushrooms and then I'd have to play the Am I About to Get uh, Poisoned game, but you know what? Did not. That's, that annoys me that that exists in that fashion. Yeah, well, I mean, if they're just gonna jump at me. Ooh, that got a little close. Yes, level up my little tiny wizard friend. You know, I feel like the devs could have probably designed the sirens to be a bit more dangerous, but maybe they are in hard mode. I could be surprised. Or maybe they are actually dangerous from below, where, you know, you can't... Okay, is this the thing? Silver ore. Okay. Sure. Whoop! Uh, well, so far the past is much more dangerous. My the past, I mean the future, because I'm really good at remembering which timeline I'm in. Ugh. Really? Nothing here? Okay. Sure. But what about to the right? Okay, we have a box. Max or up. Okay. Well, I appreciate that. Uh, hmm. Hmm. I'm now experiencing distress. Okay. Well, time to adjust our seats, go to the journal, and then shriek about the quests. Okay, I've done that. Mage mission. Right, you just want me to go beat up the royal guards. Plasma crystal from the caves. Oh dear. Well, uh... About that. Hmm. Bonk, bonk. This is the caves, isn't it? Am I incorrect in thinking that? Oh my god, I think there was so much water in the past I actually have to properly try to remember where everything is now. Hmm. Bollocks. Well, at this point, I think that, uh... I should probably go beat up the Royal Guard, because at least I learned what those were last time. Oh. Well. Eh, eh. Ah! <laughs> Darn bats. Hmm. This lightning is really... I mean, yeah, it uses up my aura power, but... Whew. Oh boy. Alright. Um, I gotta go here, and then... Uh, I believe. I 
believe this is the up. And then that's the purple door that I can't enter for some reason. And then I don't even think the double jump let me do anything at the far top of that left tower, so... At this point, I'm just gonna... Woo. Just gotta climb me some towers... So that I can, uh... Slap some royal guards. Yep. These are demons. I actually need that one, though. Bummer. There we go. And up we go. And just keep on going. Okay. Was this... Alright, we got some Ice Boy. Hey, Ice Boy. How you doing? Uh... Okay, well... That's going to require me to either play with the sand or go to the other side, so I'm going to go to the other side. Oh, okay, but... Ow. That's fair. That's also fair. I'm sorry, but it just feels like bosses are the only thing on normal difficulty that are even problematic. I don't know if it's because I found armor that I shouldn't have, but what's going on there? I keep leveling up out the ass. Wait a minute. Oh, this is a regenerative test. Never mind. I was like, what's that doing here? Wait a minute. Plasma pod. Wait a minute. Give me that. Plasma core. That's not... That's not... Yeah, plasma crystal. Okay. I don't know. I got nothing. Ow. That hurt. Just a little bit. Alright, calm down. Thank you. There were royal guards up here, weren't there? I feel like that's a thing I remember. Hmm. I don't want your hat. Get out of here. Got advisors out the ass, but I could have sworn there were royal guard up here. Okay, here's one. Chaos stole. Long flowing scarf that exudes dark energy. Increased damage, decreased defense. Lowers luck! Oh wait, that's because of the coin. Never mind. What if I do this? Still lowers luck, but only by one. You know what? You know what? That's fine. Hey, bud. Alright. Well, that's two. Uh, sure, I'll save. Why not? Alright. That is three. And four. Is there one more over here? Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna double check this room just in case. Just in case I'm actually dumb. Hmm. Nope. Definitely nothing I can do there right now. Alright. Whoop. Okay, well, these two are in quick vicinity, so I'm just gonna go and slap these boys up. And then I can turn this side quest in and... Profit? Question mark? I'm going with Profit question mark. Ah! At least this music is jamming, though. Okay. And now we're going to go and use an item to go more better faster. Was it warp chart? Last gate used, yeah. There we go. Alright. And that will allow me to GTFO. To... Friendly, friendly people keep. Where I can be like, hey guys, how's it going? So... Well, it's done. The demons are routed. The Kimi army weakens. Good. I've never been so long without orders. I can lead a unit, but I've never had to make bigger decisions. I know what you mean. I thought my clan would always be there to tell me what to do. Then when they weren't, I needed a... 
needed to take action, but maybe action without reason. This isn't as simple as it should be, Lene. You rat. Okay, well. You just gave me, like, a fuckload of money, too. I don't care if the leukemia want peace. Until that memo gets to all of the soldiers, we have to stay on guard. Oh, boy. Alright, well. Oh, you have a quest. Lene, I've been thinking about what you found out about Valette. That it gets destroyed? Yes, if Valette's gone and the Lakimi continue living here for a thousand years, they must have cured the bleakness, right? Otherwise, how would they have survived? Huh, I guess so. And if they cured it, you could find out how, and then I can finally do something about it. Sure, now I'll do what I can. It probably won't just be in that library, but maybe the facility where I found the time spinner would have records. Oh boy. Did you find anything? It looked like they have developed some treatments now. Oh, well, it's just as well that I wandered around randomly and found it. Yeah! <laughs> Knowledge! Brought back everything I could find, maybe it can help. But they never cured it. Over the years, it just got less and less deadly, I guess. That's unfortunate. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. You did everything you could. And I'm sure these notes will be extremely useful. Thank you. Maybe we can help some people. And it occurred to me, the symptoms are all about longing and quick tempers and things. Maybe that's what makes the Lakim so aggressive. They never got over the bleakness. I suppose that would make sense. Maybe it's not really their fault. They were stranded here, after all. They still made a choice, Nell, but maybe it was an understandable one. Oh my god! Oh, new quest. Nell, hi! Oh, the wizard landed! What a lovely little demon wizard. Hi, Lene. How are you? I'm good at... I've been back to my time, and it looks like things I've done here, the Lakeem in my time, has changed, Nell. It's become weaker. And Valette? No change there yet, but there's gotta be a way. Wow. Lene, you can change time. That's amazing. I know. It means I can really stop Lakeem. I can save my family. But a thousand years of history? That's a lot to change. What are you saying? I have to do this. Of course, I just... No, we don't. This is a terrible idea. I just want you to be careful. I can't ask you to change more than you have to. Getting you to get treatments from the future and everything, it could have unintended consequences. Killing people now to save people in the future, there's got to be a better way, a more peaceful way. I know, that's why I left Elana alive, Now, I think there are still peaceful options. The Lakeem you know could still be made a better place. And maybe it starts with treating the bleakness now. The Lakeemi rulers... Bleh, got a face full of spit. Help! Mm. Rulers here brought plasma pods from Valette, creatures that radiate plasma. I bet they have some deep within the castle. If you could bring me some, I'll use them and the information you gave me to synthesize a treatment. Consider it done. Oh boy. How many plasma pods do you need again? Three should do it. Need any alchemy help? Hell yeah. Obliterate foes with a range of shenanigans. Crush foes with enormous hammer. Horizontal laser of electric destruction. I like all of these items. I can technically get them all. Let's look at the rings quickly. Reduce damage taken, refresh mine, increasing or recover a rate. I kind of dig that one. That one's fun. And then just reinforcing orbs. Hmm. Does it do more than just one? Okay, I get two damage from that. And then fire orbs, the other one I use. And... I mean, I may as well use these. Plasma orb. Thinking face. Hmm. Either way. Uh, okay. We're going to get the royal ring. And then I think I can get all of these necklaces. Yeah. Okay. So. Apparently I'm level 35. Huzzah! Anyway. Uh, orbs. Okay. Right, so. I picked up. Plasma Geyser. Let's throw Plasma Geyser over here and see what it's like. What was Pyro Ring? Watch what's Pyro Ring. Immolate melee attacks causing them to ignite enemies. Ooh, yeah, that is a nice one. Um, hmm. Shield Ring, Pyro Ring. Eh, we can put the Royal on fire, maybe. I kind of like having these two as Pyro and Shield for now. Because Shield does some very silly things. Uh, and instead of Colossal Blade, we do Colossal Hammer. And see what happens. Maybe. Um, hmm. 
Okay, let's check on up here. Whoa! Quests! Hey, thought I'd give R R Ramita a break. He works so hard. Anyway, looking after this guy isn't so bad. How's he doing? He's a fighter, I can tell. Bleakness hit him hard, but he's not giving up. Sometimes I can't believe Valette would even send people here, knowing what the bleakness could do to them. No wonder the Lakimi rebelled. I don't blame them. Look at this. I never wanted to fight in a war. It was just a job. Shoot. It's a good thing Herstel's not around. She'd have my hide. Treasonous talk like that. I mean, you know. No one really likes fighting. Really. Except those that do. And they're crazy. How about a subject change, eh? We're running low on food again. I'm thinking we need something more substantial than bird legs. What? There were some wyverns in the caves last time I was down there. They're territorial beasts, but they've got some meat on them. I think I already have what you need. Like, for real. Think you could take them on? Sounds like fun. Great, bring me three of their tails, would you? Boy, howdy. Oof, these things are heavy. You got the wyvern tails? Fabulous. You hear that? One strength restoring feast coming right up. Get some tail. Mmm, delightful. Wonder if the Lakimi have any good recipes. Who knows? Do you have anything new, fun? Ooh, Dragoon Armor. Beautifully painted chest piece that belies its protective qualities. I mean, yeah, but I lose a lot of attack. And I ain't about that life. What about Sautéed Wyvern Tail? Drowning in a perfectly deglazed sauce. Sure. Hey, what about Passed Out Guy? Oh my god. Hey, how are you feeling? Thumbs up. Nice. He's a brave one, he is. Barely alive and still fighting. What's that? Something to write with. Okay. Hmm? Chevier Feather Siren Ink. Yeah, for a pen, sure. Do I have those? Do I not? I don't have... I guess I don't have feathers. I should have picked up a Siren Ink unless I need multiple. Okay, well... <laughs> Magic test time. So that's probably just technically a better version of the sword? Maybe. Right, what about lightning? Oh. Okay, and then there's uh, one more. What was it? Bombardment, there we go. Shotgun blast. Well, it's a little less exciting than the... Uh, than the other two. Just a little tiny bit. Um, well? Hmm. I guess... I should go check out all this area to the left, because I'm pretty sure there's a fair... fair whack of stuff that I've uh, not done over there, on account of it being underwater. Whoa. Okay. Zap zap. Zip zap. <laughs> the fact that they just disappear in a poof like that is very satisfying. Okay, well, and there's also poison moths. I gotta remember that those exist. I could have done without them, but you know, here they are. Yep. And I can at least double jump now, so that, uh, that little parkour platforming section isn't quite as weird. Can I go up here? No. Okay. Well... Ah, rats! Ratties! Help! Oh. Probably should have seen that happening. Hey, bud. How you doing? Okay, and there was no... No kind of chicanery secrets there. Vow we well done. I do like the uh, tracking of the lightning. That's very, very nice. Alright. Okay, what about here? There's definitely water here, but I don't know if I can reach it. I don't miss the flies. Chunk. Plump maggot. Oh. Oh. Hey. Hey, how, how you boys doing? Oh. Well then. Elemental beads. Nice. Okay. Uh, any secrets here? No. Okay, well. There's some, uh, some spooky eels. 
Hey, Spoopy Eels. Jazzy, this area's music was. <laughs> so right then, what do we got? More sand? Okay. Right. But do we have secrets? No, no secrets. Feels feels potato. Oh well. Can I sneak up under the bridge? Is that a thing I can do? Kind of wonder if the eels have any fun. Items they can drop. Whoa! Oh. Actually, one damage. Okay. Well. That's awkward. One more eel, right? Yeah, I just wanna. Yeah, what's this? Eel me. Oh. Uh, well. Probably using that in the future. Woo! Without further ado, we scooch on. What do we got? 